Today we're here in Gatlinburg, Tennessee, and we're gonna head up to Anakista. Fall is already starting to, to show itself here. Dawn, are you ready? I'm ready. Let's, Let's do, do this. So we're gonna do the Ridge Rambler because they had a medical emergency on the Red Gondola, and the, they had to get the folk, the folks out of there. Yeah, so they have to release the door to get the the folks that have the medical emer. So as soon as we got up to the Ridge Rambler, which is now full. The lift started moving again. <laughs> so now we're debating, do we wanna wait for another Ridge Rambler or do we wanna go back in line again and take the chair lift? So it looked like it'd be two more Ridge Ramblers before we would get on there. We decided to come back over, stand in line again <laughs> and wait for the lift. That's what we wanted to in the first, we should have just waited. She just waited. But she did say that it, that, that it was gonna take a while and it, we didn't, didn't want to so. hire half an hour. Yeah. But it's going again, so. Approach the top station. Please raise your bar. When you're out, here comes the lift. Here we go. Ah, whoa. And we're on the lift. We're going to Anakisa. This I knew is... it would go quick. Yeah, we would have been still waiting down there for the Rambler. So I'm glad that we decided to get back on the lift again. So what happened was somebody that was in one of the chandalas decided they didn't want to be on there and they started panicking, they hit the panic button. Yeah. I'm guessing there's a panic button in there, right? I didn't know, yeah. That's what he said anyways. And so now they had to stop it and they had to, you know, had a maintenance guy to open the door to get them off because they were past the point of no return. Yeah. But, uh, you know, the folks here, they, are, they did, they did. And uh, folks are just so um, good here, you know, and, and everything else. So, they yeah. cram a lot of people in and the chandalas just to get many people up there because a lot of people are in the enclosed chair. I think you're better off in the open here. Yeah. yeah, there's the Park Vista. We got to stay there. It's a really cool hotel. Of course, almost every room above like the fourth floor has got a beautiful view. People like throwing their money on this rooftop here. Look at all the dimes. Yeah. Now they do have a sign down below I noticed that said, please don't throw things off the lift, especially on Aeromont here, which is this what this is. This is a a school that we're passing over for folks that are learning art skills, you know? There's Pottery. The chair and the horse and there's a Darth oh. Vader chair down there. No. Of course, beautiful views of Gatlinburg from up here. Definitely the highlight of a trip up to Anakista is the chairlift itself. So today we're gonna head on up. We're gonna see if anything has changed since the last time we were up here. We're gonna grab a bite to eat because we're, we're hungry. Mm -hmm. And um, we're gonna see the beautiful views. Probably just explore around, you know. What's new, right? It's Pretty new. simple. Maybe we'll see a bear because you know, a lot of times you will see bears, you know, roaming around Anakista, especially on the lift here. And that's where the Gatlinburg trolleys go to, I guess, take a break. Yeah, a nice little parking lot just for them now, over here.
Oh, that's a long ways down, right? And we're rocking, aren't we? Yeah, we are. We're moving. Yeah, so we're coming up to the halfway point here. Get your feet up. Yeah. Yeah, to get your feet up. Yeah. No drone zone. They frown upon drones. And usually there's somebody here. It don't look like there is today. <laughs> We're rocking. We are. Yeah. You know, this ride is different with every season. During the fall, you get the beautiful colors. Summer, the trees cover both sides. Winter, you can see views forever. They even have a zip line that flies through here. I don't see any zip liners at the moment and this is a good place to see the bear we've seen them down in here before we've also seen them up roaming around mm -hmm. Anakista itself but you know at the top so many butterflies down there I don't know if you can see that on camera but wow And here we come for our landing. I get those Flintstone feet a running here, huh? I gotta make a run over it. <laughs> Touchdown! So we started our adventure down here in the parkway. We've taken the lift to the top of Anakista Mountain here. And we're gonna explore around. Of course, you have Firefly Village, the Forest Adventure where Dawn rocks the bridges, Black Bear Village. Vista Gardens, which is one of my favorite spots. And then over here at night, they have the Lumina Village and the Astra Luminites or Lumina Adventure. So, yeah, we're here. We're up here at the top. So, we're hungry. We've been waiting. We wanted to come up here. That's part of the reason why we're up here is to grab a bite, you know, bite to eat, some lunch. original restaurant up here, the Smokehouse, always serves up really good dishes. They have nachos, hamburgers, and got a beautiful seating area here. You can just take in all these beautiful mountain views. And I love the detail in all their buildings up here in the bark. And it's just, it's a great feeling, a great atmosphere. And fall is slowly arriving here at Anakista. And they're, they're getting ready. And the views up here are just amazing. And down there is the Rail Runner. So here's the flavors of the week here at Pearl's Pie in the Sky. They got homemade vanilla. Ooh, they got mint chocolate chip, cookie dough, cotton candy, uh, butter, pecan, and coffee. Huh. Ice cream and cakes and pies. I always have to walk over this little bridge here. Yes. It just came off the lift. A little place where you can take your family photo here on the rail runner. And you can see there's little people up there riding down the side of the mountain. Ah.
Yeah, so they have the Tennessee sidecar and the snack shack. And the splash pad is up and running so the kids can splash around here. And, yeah, definitely lots of fun. Oh, even the deer squirts water. Well, let's head into the mercantile. Oh, they got candles, they got some Smoky Mountain suds. <laughs> that smells really good in here. It's definitely like a soapy smell, right? Yeah. We got some, oh wow, look at it. There's a pig, a cow, and a, and a goat. <laughs> they always have really unique little gifts up here. Uh, even some Smoky Mountain Southern style caviar. <laughs> Which would be mild chow chow. They do have a little bit of a little bit of everything in this shop, even some purses and earrings. Got some really cool merch here. They even have a yeah, they have a pin. Oh. So we're gonna head into Clifftop for lunch. We have never eaten here before. It's a biodegradable straw. Looks like it might be a soy straw. That's really cool. Feels like plastic. Yeah, the straw is called green print. Better than that paper straw for sure. So all the condiments are on this like Lazy Susan. And uh, the service has been really good. They sat us down immediately and took our drink order. And that's the view out our window there of the Vista Tower there. And it's it's beautiful to sit in here, isn't it? Look around, 360 degrees, the mountains. So our lunch is served. This is the Cades Cove chicken. It's a little chicken sandwich. Comes with some fries. And what did you get, Don? A chicken breast, um, some cornbread, potatoes, cornbread, and asparagus. Yeah, so the Kate's Cove chicken has got bacon, some cheese, of course, the chicken itself on a real nice roll with a little bit of um, pickle. And the fries look amazing, yes, nice and salted. Looks like a little bit of seasoning on that. And what's the purple stuff? I don't know. <laughs> what is the purple stuff? I don't know. I'm not gonna eat it. <laughs> You have to ask. You have to ask what it is. Maybe it's a burned up potato. No, I don't think so. I think it's just, um, maybe it's like a cabbage or something. I don't know. I'm oh. not sure what that I'll is. have to find out. It almost tastes like a, like a wine sauce, right? Mm -hmm. And then, we still don't know what the purple stuff is. Cornbread. And I'm going to get a little, a little bit of ketchup for my fries. I like to mix my ketchup and, and mustard for my fries. And here is my chicken sandwich. Looks really, really good. Ooh. Let's try this out. I use like this honey mustard sauce on the chicken, which is really good. It's very sweet. Uh, the bacon sets it off real well. And the fries are, are average, but they're, they're good fries. Oh. So how is that cornbread? It's sweet. So it's, really like, 
it's a very sweet cornbread. Oh, it looks good. So we did find out what the purple stuff is. It's a, it's a potato. It's a purple potato, right? Yeah. And so they have the tap house over here so you can get your brews and then just walk around or maybe sit over here by the fire. Yet again, the beautiful views. Now this is where you wait for the Ridge Rambler. And pretty soon it's going to be fall here in the Smokies. Ah, another scarecrow. He's waving to everybody, He's saying, hello y'all. Come up to Vista Gardens, right? And take a look at the gardens. Some beautiful roses. Oh yeah, even a, yeah, a little, little butterfly or a moth or something. Oh, there he goes. And <laughs> there's another little bridge. Dawn, Dawn, don't don't do that. <laughs> uh, look at the the views from up here. We have Firefly Village down below. That's the Great Smoky Mountains National Park straight ahead. We always stop by and check out the little gnome village here. Oh, there's one there greeting us. Wow, there are so many bees in here. I don't think I've ever seen this many bees in, in one spot. They're really, really, really liking all the, the flowers up here. Yeah, so that's the new birdhouse playland that's supposed to be open sometime in September. It's got a huge woodpecker and yeah, they had a little setback, that little fire not too long ago, but it looks like they've they repaired it and yeah, welcome to Vista Gardens. And we're right here at the base of Vista Tower. And we're gonna head up there and see what the views are like today. They're usually amazing. Long ways down. Supposed to be another mountain coaster over there. You got a little play area for the kids, a little birdhouse village. And here comes the scary part. Yep, you can stand over the ground here on this glass panel. It's some scary stuff. So they call this the highest point in Gatlinburg, up here at the tower. Yeah. Of course, you can see a space needle just over there. Oh, there's Over Mountain, and the trams are about to meet right in the center. And there they go. Oh, there's Skylift Park and Skybridge on the other side of the mountain over there on Crockett Mountain. And there's Mount LeConte. A little bit of cloud cover up there. A couple little, it's like rain clouds, even though it's not supposed to rain today. 
So the new addition is looking good down there. It's supposed to open, I think, sometime in September. But they have a new mountain coaster over there, too. Yeah. I want to play in that bird village. Like, it, it looks fun. It's for kids. But, you know, know. It, looks, it looks fun, don't it? Mm -hmm. And it's misting in here. It's kind of like a, it feels good, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. And we meet once again, Willow. Well, hello. <laughs> yeah, it's been, it's been a little bit, hasn't it? To move out. To move out. To move out. move out of New Jersey, I got taxed. Well, they have a little rope chorus here you can walk. We've done this a few times, right? It is fun. The kids like it. So we've done the Astra Illumina, and it's a lot of fun. I highly recommend it. Of course, it's only at night, but it was it was a lot of fun. We need to come back and do this again. Dawn's favorite, the treetop skywalk. Ooh. Dawn. Don't. Come on. I thought, but I thought we had an agreement, didn't we, on this one? <laughs> I'm getting used to it, though. Dawn. Dawn. There's a lot of peat. <laughs> this is the busiest I've ever seen the bridges. There's just a line of folks waiting to do them. <laughs> Come on. Well, yeah, there is pretty big gaps between the boards, and if one of these boards were to break, I would end up down there. <laughs> he is cute. water with electrolytes added for taste. And he said it's dishwasher safe except for the lid. So you can reuse it and it's a metal too. And they say that you can refill this throughout the park so they must have dispensers. I'm guessing it's the water fountain. And it kind of looks like it's decorated for Halloween, don't it? Yeah. Really and it, so Anakista has their own water. Mm -hmm. I'm going to huh. drink it. You going to drink some? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a, it's a heavy duty yeah. metal and it keeps the water. Who would have known? Ooh, it's um, it's cold. it's cold. They got a lot of really unique gift shops up here. All kinds of items. <laughs> you can even get a Bigfoot, Don. Mm -hmm. Burr. Yeah, he is kind of cute. And we are on our way back down. Don's excited about that water. It's it's kind of a warm one today. Mm -hmm. Beautiful views on the way down. Going down is even better than coming up because you get to see, you know, everything. And there's a bear on our way down. Oh, the right, here we go. Wow. Oh, she's got three or four of them. Oh, the little babies are behind her. Oh, they're adorable. And there goes one and two. And there they go underneath the tree. And there's a third one coming up from behind. There it is. Ah, so mom and three oh, cubs. They were adorable. They were. They all look healthy, didn't they? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. It's nice to see that wildlife and nature. I would say, what, at least two times out of three, we always see a bear up here, right? Mm -hmm. So, pretty good odds. And there's some more bears down there. There's another mom 
And some cub and some cubs. Yeah, yes. Those are little, little cubs. All the cubs are are playing. Oh, they're adorable. So this is another mom. It's mom and and two more cubs, and we're gonna pass right over the top of them. Okay. Oh, the babies are so cute. Yeah, they're little. That one's really tall. Oh my gosh, you're like right below us. See, there's our, there's our. Oh. Right over the top. I've never seen bears from this angle. I don't think I've ever seen two moms with three cubs each in like the same day. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's like a herd. Oh, them babies are cute too. Cute as buttons. Mom's teaching them how to how to get grubs. Get some bugs. <laughs> That's a first yeah. ever. They're adorable. Oh, they were great, weren't they? So what did you think about Cliff Top? We had Cliff Top and I ordered the grilled chicken breast and it came up like a breaded chicken breast. I wasn't expecting that. Maybe I didn't understand what I was reading on the menu. Well, it said and it had asparagus and cornbread, and the potatoes were good too. Um, it said pan seared, yeah. and I was thinking the same thing as you. Um, it did have like a little bit of a wine, a wine sauce, right? Mm -hmm. You know, and uh, but yeah, I had a little bit. She had a little bit of mine, and it was good. Uh, the food was good. It was mm -hmm. really good. Um, yeah, we finally got in there, right? We were able to do a review. It's been years in the making. But well, we did. Anakista is looking as good as ever. Uh, everything is in bloom. The bears really sealed the deal at the end. Um, it's one of my favorite places to visit. And I highly recommend it if you're in Gatlinburg. But folks, that's going to do it for today. Here at Anakista, here above Gatlinburg. If you guys like this vlog, give it a thumbs up. Also, if you haven't, please subscribe because we got a lot more coming up. Fall is coming. We're gonna bring you all that. We're gonna bring you Fall at Anakista. We're gonna, they're also gonna be opening that new Hellbender mountain coaster. And my collar is a little bit weird, but anyways, we love you and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone. Bye. Thanks for watching. You kind of feel like Peter Pan, you know, f flying over all the, the, the houses, yeah. yeah. But it's Gatlinburg. There's so much to do here, so much to see.